Hi everybody and welcome back to another part. Thank you all for hitting that thumbnail and checking out this video. It does mean a lot. If you guys, just at the start here, just so I can say it, if you guys could leave a like, leave a comment down below and hit the subscribe button and the bell icon, just to keep up to date with the rest of this walkthrough, that would help a great deal. And now that that's out of the way, I can jump straight into the game. So for this part, I'm not going to be doing anything of the main quest, I'm mainly just going to be doing some side quests, just to level up a little bit. And right off the bat here, I'm going to be doing healers and healers. Now, I can't quite remember what any of this quest is about, so I, yeah, kind of looking forward to seeing it. In between this part and the last part as well, I did some of the lower level quests on Pandora, just stuff that really wouldn't it, like, it was not challenging at the level I'm at so I just did them quickly to get him out of the way all right what's this a vault hunter what are you doing up in here something about a lost staff boil ring a bell seriously I put that request up like seven years ago back when I had a respectable establishment not this crap pile you see now but I am glad you're here See, I'm trying to help out all the poor bastards affected by this war, but yo, straight up, we are running short on med supplies. We need hexaprizine, skag oil, melodinax, and hemopax. Track some down for me, will ya? Of course. Uh, what did he say? Blood pack, blood packs and collect meds, Coolio. Okay, these are just hip hypos. I almost said hypnos then. Hypos, don't really need hypos. Let's go find these things. I'm not just a doctor in medicine. My practice is in trauma, but my residency was in rhyme. Word. Oh snap! I forgot to give you a mixtape, Jamama. Let me check the map first. Don't want to interrupt that thrilling conversation. Okay, that's cool. That's very cool. I like it. So it's just in a straight line, more or less. Maybe later, boyo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I get it. You're concentrating on your flow. I'll hit you with it later. Can I get up there? Let's check. I don't know. Yes, yeah, they go. Yeah. Black market yeah, I can. Cool. I'll bet dollars to D's nuts he stole those supplies. Dude's a pushover, though. Just threaten him, and I'll give him up. Wait, I have to fight some. Oh, God. I have to. Damn it. I fell off. Oh, God damn it. It was going so well. Can't even climb up this thing. Right, now I can carry on. Now, I have no idea what's up here. Uh, oh, I thought I fell over again. Oh, God. I got some supplies here, and I'm happy to sell them for a reasonably marked up price. I'm just trying to feed my family. You understand, right? Please, don't shoot. There's been enough bloodshed around here. Just give me the cash, and we can make a deal. Yeah, yeah, we've all got a sob story. As for me, I've got patience to heal and no patience to deal. Just threaten him and be done with it. You don't know what it's like down here. People don't eat for days. It's a nightmare. Whoa, whoa. Okay, fine. Take them. They're yours. Just please don't hurt me. <laughs> That's what Thank I'm you. talking about. What kind of I doctor is this? Straight up fear yeah, what kind of doctor am I working for? Like, is he, is he this planet's equivalent of Dr. Zed? Or Z yeah, it's Dr. Zed, isn't it? From the first game. And I guess this guy making zombies and shit. All sorts of... abhorrent crimes Bandits against nature. A bunch of my medical supplies. Find them and blast their janky ride. <laughs> Alright, what am I doing? Blowing up... Oh, oh shit. Snap! Oh, snap. Oh, right, okay. There's some stuff here. There we go. 15 left and two blood packs. So I would imagine two blood packs and 15 meds are waiting for me in this last place. Now, how do I get there? Uh, up here, is it? Yeah, thank God. Right. Oh, dip. The pharmacy. Been abandoned for a while, but there should be some supplies left. How come every planet has some kind of bug problem? 
Even a city planet? How do these bugs survive in a city planet? Bear in mind, I suppose, that most of this planet has been at war for... since time in Morium. So, yeah. That's probably how. No one's really looking to exterminate bugs when they're trying to exterminate each other. Alright, oh, yeah, he's got double layer. That's taking that person. Why? Okay, Digiclone, you're up. Sentry bar, you're up as well. Let's take down these creatures, these pains in my ass. Ah, I like the Digiclone, he's so cool. And luckily, these guys are very low level compared to me. Not low enough though that they are not. A nuisance. Let's say nuisance. Yeah, nuisance is good. Describes these guys pretty well. Alright, blood. That's only one. Yo, that's all the medicine! We still need another hemo pack, but we'll figure it out. Come on back, player. Um, I know what you're thinking. What's this doctor doing trying to be a rapper? But listen, medicine, it comes and goes. But my rhymes, that's healing for the soul. Look, just let me spit something for you. See, I bust raps like I bust caps, and that's that. Don't mess with my knapsacks full of fat stacks, or else you get the clapbacks. Word? <laughs> Word. I have no idea what the hell he just said. Ah. It's one of those, uh, it's one of those, like, sort of moments you sort of smile and nod. Because the man's clearly insane, and has access to a lot of medication. Both of which have nothing to do with each other, I'm positive. Now, I did see... what was this? Map transition... no. I did see there was a quest thing there, so... Let's check that out. Might do that then, after I finish this. Whatever that is. No idea. Where am I going? Through here? And... nope. Wait, there's the quest thing. Wherever that is. Yeah, that is the thing on the wall. Why is it? Why is it? Is it good? It's, uh... Oh, shit. What's this? Technical Nogout. Find a scientist named Quinn and get your hands on some sweet anti maloan tech he promised Lorelei. Vault Hunter. There's this Quinn bloke, scientist, owes us some fancy nerd tech, but we haven't heard from him in a while. Go make sure he's not dead, alright? And either way, try to get me the Digistruct plans for this nog hacking thing he's been working on. It would really help us out if we could turn those little bastards to our side. Wait, those little bastards are mechanical? Like I thought they were actual people. But they're robots you can hack? Or do they just have implants? They might just have implants that you can hack. In which case, they may as well be mechanical. They're basically little, little robocops. Now then, time to get paid. Not that I particularly care about the money, I just really need the XP. Looks like we're still a little short on hemoglobin. Hemoglobin just roving is the title track on my mixtape, by the way. Did you want one, or no? Still no? Okay, screw it. I'll donate some of my own. Grab this empty emo pack and give me an assist. What do I do? What? Pick up empty... You do what you do. I'll uh, follow behind you. Yeah, this guy does not really instill confidence in his sort of medical skill. Look at him. Okay, Blood now. everywhere. Very, very carefully. Breathe. We'll get through this. Just use the hemo pack. So, yep. Okay. That'll do. Sorry. Oh, uh, I didn't mean. Oh, sorry. Yeah. Yeah. You know, did the job. I okay. got some blood. Um. Thanks. I think. But at least maybe this will finally give me some street cred. Uh, Maybe I'll get one of those sweet Atlas robot arms. But hey, don't worry about me, I'll survive. And so will my patience, thanks to you. 
Mouse Schuler is finally ready to staff up and heal the hurt. Don't be such a Best chance pussy. On that mixtape, by the way. Still no? Word. Word. No, don't be such a pussy. I mean, Reese has got a robotic arm. How bad could it be? Not quite sure how we ended up getting a robotic arm. Probably should look into that. Might be an interesting story there. How did a pencil pusher get a robotic arm? How did he lose his perfectly functioning arm? No, I don't want to laser tag one. Well, not yet, anyway. Let's check the quest log. So, I'm... Hmm. Yeah, I'm kind of running out of quests. That's not good. I may have to look online to see if there's anywhere I can look at. Like any places of interest to check out. Where am I going? What's that? Alright, so that's the, uh, that's the location I have to go to. That's like his secret hideout. This scientist guy. Uh, I do wonder why a lot of the scientists found hiding in the outskirts, but let's call it what it is. See, was, was a good idea. Because clearly every other bandit had that idea. So I want to say it was particularly bright. Let's do this. Where are you, Doc? If Intel says that scientist is here, then he's here. Keep searching. Ah, oh, crap! Vault Hunter contact! High priority target! Let's do some killing. Come on, come on! Oh, this isn't going to be bad. It could be because I am level 15 and some of the... Well, these guys are pretty much my level. Until I level up. Hopefully this quest will push me a little bit over the edge. And I will come away with this being level 16. With that weird angel music as well, I level up and it's like... Oh. The choir of angels. I'm just babbling now. Oh, it's going on. There's a lot of high-tech crap here for a sewer. And, you know, I, don't, I, I know it's called an outskirt and stuff like that. It's a city planet, but still. This is a lot of tech. Go away, you Malawan bastards! I am perfectly happy sitting in this closet forever with the rat species and... whatever that is! <laughs> Oi! Science fella! Uh, Quinn! Lorelei sent me. Lorelei? Oh, yes, uh, the Atlas lady with the, with the guns and the hair. Okay, I'm coming out. Yes, yes, I, I promised Lorelei an incredible weapon that only I, a verifiable genius, could create. A nog-hacking grenade. <laughs> That's why Malawan's after me. Now, this way, please. Yeah, I prefer burst fire, not to run fully automatic. More tests on my Nog subjects, and the Nog hacking grenade will be ready to go. What? Where are my Nogs? Oh, they, they must have escaped during the fight. Uh, uh, if I'm going to finish this weapon, I'll need them back. Ugh. Luckily, I have a backup plan. <laughs> but I'll need your help. I'm digestructing a unique vehicle nearby. Go get it! What is this, some kind of nog-catching vehicle? Has it got some kind of scoop on the front? Because it might need a scoop. If I'm catching people. No. Ah, well. The this vehicle is, is basically the technical. Uh, science barrels, which will send my escape nogs back to me through complicated digistruct technology. Technology which I don't have time to explain to you. That's one test knock! A good start! Okay, yeah. I can do this. Just shoot at small people. I'll shoot in the general vicinity of small people. Anyone can do this. A fool could do this. Where's the third one? There he is. 
Oh, did I run him over? Nope, fine. That's all of them. I will now hack into their suits and add some special upgrades of my own design to create my fighting Nogadors. I'll be waiting for you at my console whenever you're ready. Hey, I got him. Okay, let's go. Is that what? Did I just read that right? That's a one XP. Did I get one XP for killing that guy? Like, what is the point? Well, anyway, that doesn't matter. None of that matters. What matters? Let me explain is how nogs work. You see, their helmets project an augmented reality game over the real world. So these brainwashed idiots actually think they're playing a video game. <laughs> we can hijack the game system to show their allies as enemies. So I've been killing people unaware who that they are actually shooting at me. Yeah, I feel like a little bit of a dick now. Just a little bit. No, no regrets or anything. They were technically shooting at me. All I have to do is reprogram the Nog's enemy identification protocols, causing them to target Malawan instead of us. Now I'll just prepare the non delivery system. It's time to place your bets, my fans! Let's go! <laughs> <laughs> about that, uh, listen, I, I certainly haven't been pit fighting reprogrammed nogs for the locals to bet on. <laughs> certainly not. Now, use the button there to call the first Nogador into the ring. Into the ring. <laughs> yeah, way to keep up with your story, buddy. I call him El Fuego. A Nog enhanced with the power of fire. Everyone likes fire, right? Ow! That's not supposed to happen. The special upgrade must have malfunctioned. But it's okay. We've got two more. Call in the next one. I dread to think what's happening next. This one I'll call the Conductor. <laughs> Powerful as a raging lightning storm. <laughs> That didn't work either. But I can fix this. Let me just a uh, second. No fancy gimmicks this time. Okay, now call the last one. And the last one to die is I'm going to guess Ice. Yeah, I'm gonna say ice. Toxins. I'll call him Nagador Maximo. Here's hoping we don't lose this one too. <laughs> Checking systems. <laughs> the hacking worked perfectly this time. The Nog will now target his own allies. And just in time, too. That's the proximity alarm. Malawan is coming after me again. Hold them off while I send the weapon plans to Lorelei. Lorelei, I'm sending you the Digistruct blueprints now. Quinn, good to hear from you. I see the data coming in. Data transfer in progress. Hold them off. What am I supposed to do? Oh, I shoot these guys. What about the little mini guy, the mini me? Like, is he gonna do anything from that ring, or am I just gonna shoot everybody? Not that I mind. I mean, it's just good to know. Do I have backup or not? Apparently not. Let's take these guys out. Screw you! Yes, look at the little Maximo go. I can't actually see if he's doing anything. I assume he is. Though. He's running around. He's having a whale of a time. Yeah, that's what freedom feels like, little guy. Yeah, level up. The data is uploading. Quite slowly. Keep fighting. God damn it, we've mastered space travel but not super fast Wi-Fi. Really? I mean we can what they just struck people, we can't send a file faster. 
Oh, what the hell is this? What? Well, how do they get a ship down here? That is mad piloting. Oh yeah, that ship's coming down. Oh, we exploded. That's not good. That's not nice. How many of these guys are there? Ah, oh, it's a badass trooper. Yeah, these are the guys that pissed me off in the last video. I'm gonna look forward to killing these guys. Oh god. Yeah, not to, you know, rub it in our faces or anything. Yeah, he seems really calm considering there's still Malawan here. Like, I am locked in a gun battle and he's like, Vault Hunter, please, take one of these grenade mines. It's like, do you not see the big guy I am trying to kill? And if you don't see him now, that's probably because I killed him. Maximo, help me take up this last guy. Now then. What? Oh, cool. Well, would appear our business is concluded, and uh, my verifiable genius status is beyond question. As for me, I'll be continuing my Nog reprogramming efforts. The locals need something to bet on, after all. <laughs> uh, I, I mean, uh, for the war effort and, and whatnot. Yes. Please leave now! Alright, I'm off. Uh, you enjoy your uh, whatever you're doing. Some kind of betting, or whatever. Any good guns here? Sniper rifle. God. Either sniper rifles or very shit guns. A uh, very shit shotgun, at any rate. Well, that's not too bad. I'll not take the bother. Because even at my level, these things are a bit lower level, like a bit too low level. Which is a shame. Boom. And up and out we go. Now, the main question is, what do I do? So, I've done a few of these. Uh, most of these are actually main quests. Uh, never mind about that. Invasion of Privacy. Go to Athenus. Bugger. Where's the fast travel station? Fast travel? It's gotta be a... F there it is. Oh, is that a spawn station? Oh, that's a spawn point. Oh god damn it. And the nearest one is all the way there. Oh dick. Okay. Let's go through here. Meridian Metroplex. Gotta be something in the city itself, I think. There gotta be a you know, closer sort of uh, fast travel point. Now then, what to do, what to do? I'll do this one, this quest, I think, I hope. It's level 17, I'm level 16, it should be, you know, challenging, but not impossible. And I'm going to have to then look for more quests. I think there might be one or two on the ship. If not, I'm going to have to hit up online to Google. Google is my friend, and find a few more. I'll just find out the fastest way to level up, I guess. Now then... I'm in here. Where is the closest... Oh, bollocks. Nowhere near. Oh, god damn it. Fine. Anyone care to give me a vehicle? Didn't think so.
Oh, he's gonna go up, he's gonna go up, he's gonna go up. He's on fire. Burn you. Ah, oh, screw you. Right, never mind about that. Let's go to fast travel. Fast travel, fast travel. It's all about that fast travel. Yeah, that is where I'm going, right? Oh, what's this? Oh. No, no space laser tag. The other one. Ugh. Ooh, what's this? Sonic Cyclone. Okay. Uh, right, so if I carry on down here and keep going, I should hit the Atlas base, I think. Yeah. That's what I want to do. Fast travel, baby! Coolio. Now then, go to it. Nope, wrong one. Damn it. Go to Athenus. I, sh I think there's a few quests on here as well. Well, there's one. For certain. Now then, do I... Ha I still have that, yeah, invasion of privacy. Uh, that's a bit, bit of a pain in the ass. Every time it sort of resets the map. I have no idea what I'm supposed to do here. Does anyone know? Any help? Anything? Mission giver, holy spirits. I can do that. Not just yet though. I'll have to start back from here, won't I? Meh. Dr. Zed's meds vending machines are a great way to get patched up if you have taken a beating. Which is usually how I spend most of these videos. Getting my, you know, my ass handed to me. Surprisingly, this walkthrough has actually gone rather smoothly compared to how I thought it was going to go. Which was a lot of shooting, uh, no damage being done, and the game over that that screen that basically what you're seeing now as i respawn a lot of that not as much though like there was a fair deal into the game before i died the first time that was impressive i do like this planet it's a very nice look to it what the hell if mala wants taking my stuff you got to get it back uh, i knew i shouldn't have left stuff lying around when i was before I met Maya, I only held on to things I could carry or stash. Because I thought for a second Athena's was going to be different. <laughs> I've leveled up. I t totally did not realize that I did not spend that point. I, yeah. Need to get out of that habit of just not forgetting, you know, just not spending the points, just forgetting they're there. Because they're going to stack up otherwise. And then that, uh, you know, it'd be great to spend them. But the bit of time before I realize that was, that's going to be a bitch. Because I'll just be woefully underskilled. Synchronicity, most insertions. New stem them Fine. Which is the one that. Is it this one? Yeah, there you go. Oh, what's this? Charged relay. Ah, it doesn't matter. Yeah, my shields are almost that level with my health, which is weird. Don't think that's ever happened before. Can I carry this? Yeah. Wait, if they found all this stuff... Crap, my notebook! You have to go make sure my notebook is safe. That gets out, I'll literally die. It is all my super secret notes. Super secret notebook coming. <laughs> Boom. How much XP do I get? 100. Okay, that's not too bad. That's better than that one XP I got for destroying that one vehicle. 
Yeah, I'm gonna run past these guys, not gonna bother shooting at them. Just so I can find this bloody notebook. No! Where is it? Who took my notebook? Hey, say hello, but it's me, your private bean. Quit burning people's homes down for a second. Check out this emo chick's tome diary. It's hilarious. Here, listen. Um, running scared. Day one. I think my whole family is dead, and I don't know what to do. <laughs> right? That's not. You can't. Hulk Hunter, you gotta do something. Him. <laughs> Day three. I miss my family so much. Sometimes it feels like my heart is a fist clenched around a piece of barbed wire, and it hurts so much to hold on to the wire, but I'm afraid to let go of the wire because then I won't have it anymore. Womp womp. <laughs> <laughs> That's not about me. That's just a, a song I'm writing. It's about politics. Yeah, they're bad, right? Forget that. Just find this guy before he finds my secrets! Alright, let's go find this guy who's reading her deep and personal thoughts on the, uh, what do they call it? Com waves, interwaves, radio waves, whatever. Whatever they use to communicate in this. The airwaves. Airwaves is a term. Multi use. It's good for everything. Comms, radio, telephone, whatever. Airwaves. Run! Be distracting, will ya? Where are you, you bastard? Come on. Doing my best. For some reason, there are a lot of guys here, despite there no it being nothing here anymore. We took the vault fragment, or whatever was here, I can't quite recall, and the guys just didn't bother leaving. I assume there was something else here they wanted. Sorry, little guy, you're going down. Uh, you think they'd run away. Considering how many of their friends are killed, you'd think they'd just be like, nope, actually. On second thought, I should probably run away from my life. But nope, they stay, they hold their ground. And part of me is like, you're dull. The other part of me is like, fair play. Where are these bloody things? Where are these pages? God damn it, will you piss off? I'm trying to find the little girl's diary. Or parts of it. That's so hard to believe. And down. Ah, there you go. Where is he? Oh, I have to run back. No, I don't. Fine. Cool. That might be as long as, I, as long as I don't have to backtrack. Day 939. Why did I come to this dumbass monastery? All the stupid monks stink like Gouda, and I haven't seen any cheese since I got here. Ugh. There's one chick with blue hair I keep seeing around the market. She's got a crazy cool Maliwan gun. Maybe I can steal something from her and use it to trade for the gun. Uh oh. Hope no monks are listening. I am so disappointed in you, child. Mother Mendel, I didn't mean to make fun of your cheese stink! Ah, this sucks! 
Ah, who's shooting? All right, salt trooper. No quest here. Yeah. Hello, my. That's an impressive mustache. Holy spirits! There's an infestation of. What? There's an infestation. All oh, right, in the monk's most sacred site, the holy distillery. You must come quickly. The holy distillery is infested with rats. This way. Thank the six storms, my prayers are answered. Yeah, I'll I am come Brother back to Mendel of the impending storm, sworn to an oath of non-violence. So I must beg your assistance with these ferocious rats. You must eradicate them for me. There we are. Now, inside, quickly, before the rats completely infest this holy place. Yeah, I'll I'll come back to that one. I can do that. Where is he though? Oh, he's at the very end. Of course he is. He's at the other end of the map to the side that I started on. Yeah, piss off guys. I need to go and kill your friend and I might come back for you. Who knows? To be fair though, I might just yeah, have probably enough time to finish this quest and I'll call it a day. I might do a few of the other side quests. You know, if I find any. In between, just a little, you know, push up a bit because leveling up in this game is not quick. And I don't want a lot of this walkthrough to be sort of me just doing side stuff. I'm going to try and keep it to the main quest as much as possible, with a few side quests thrown in. Oh yeah, he's going down. Nope, swap to fire. Alright, this isn't doing as much damage as I hope. And I'm almost dead. No, I don't want to die. I don't want to die in a grave. That's weird. That's a weird thing to say. Oh yeah, I'm dead. I am so dead. No doubt it's because they're all level 17 and I'm still using lower level guns. Yeah. I'll actually might run, run through my inventory at the moment. See if there's anything here I can use. I should have quite a bit on me. Where is the inventory? Here's the inventory. Hmm, that's still level 14. Let's see if there's anything new. That's level 15. That's not bad. Don't like the uh, multiplication damage though, so that means it's a shotgun, sort of, the shotgun thing going on there. New no, level 12. That's level 16. That's level 12, level 13. Oh god. Yeah, great, whatever. Fine. That's level 14. That's still level 14 though. Hmm. Hi, right, what's this? Nothing will fill that boy. Fair enough, that's two fair, this fires two bullets. Let me use this then. How do I get up there? Oh yeah, god damn it. I have to go around, do I? Yeah, it looks like it. Do I? Hang on. Let me check the map. Uh, right, yeah, keep going this way. Then go over the bridge. Ignore that guy. Oh, well, those guys. 
it's going to be as much of a, you know it's going to be a big enough pain in the ass fighting the guys in the area I'm going to. I don't need to fight these guys on the way. I'm not even sure if this is going to work because this and the energy gun I got are using the same ammo source. So. Bring him down! Oh, he's... yeah, that's actually doing a bit of damage. No, oh no. God, those things are powerful. And not... oh, shit. Yeah, those things are annoyingly powerful. Ah, beanie. You're going down, buddy. Really? Oh my god! Right, one more attempt. One more attempt, and if I don't get it this time, I'll call it a day, but... Oh my god! Yeah, that's not gonna work. Hyperion Health Desk recommends shoot more and miss less. It's not gonna work for no other reason than that's drawing on the same... ...source. Uh, 16... yeah. That's gotta be swapped out with something else. Shotgun? Sure. Ooh, this looks interesting. Is that like organic matter at the end there? Yeah, okay. Alright, attempt number three. If this doesn't work, I don't know what to do. And I'm, I might come back to this probably in the next part. And I'll keep at it. A good idea would be to go on to the nearest gun shop and just buy something my level. Which I might do. There he is. Come on, Beanie. Where is he? Has he run away? Where is he? I can't see him. Which <coughs> shouldn't be too much of a problem. He does stand up. There he is. Oh shit. This is not going my way. Where are you, Beanie? Got him. No argument here. Oh, this, I'm gonna die. Oh, come on, come on, grab the key. Yeah, cool. Nice. That's what I like to hear, considering I don't have that much health. So too far away is probably too far. Now that I give it some thought. It's not that far. I don't think. What? How, how, how do I get down there? There goes nothing! Hey! Made it! Nice! I'm glad those guns are in good hands now. Noah, could you bring all my stuff back? So that's radiation and that's corrosive! Nice! Yeah, and I should probably get rid of a few of the lower level guns I got. Just because there's a lot of this stuff I don't want to throw away, all the stuff I have. Mm. Yeah, okay, I'll go for that one. 
And what about this one? Okay, I got nothing. That's 12, but that's not for me. And that is it for me, but that's for 18. So that's, yeah, I'm nowhere near that level at the moment. That... Yeah, okay, I'll take it. Get rid of some of these. What do I mean? I am. What? That was my inventory full. I just dropped a bunch of stuff. Oh, you bloody thing. Alright, time to go. Can I fast, uh, sort of fast travel? Yeah, I can, cool. So I can just, pretty much from anywhere, just fast travel straight back to Sanctuary. That's what it seems like, anyway. It could just be because I was standing next to the fast travel point, or the respawn point. It's something I'll, yeah, I'll probably look into it at some point. Anyway, let's go and drop this stuff off to Ava, and then call it a day. I've leveled up. I'm level 16. That's pretty good going. Um, hopefully I get a level 17 in the next video, and then the video after that, I will be going straight on to the quest, or whatever it's called. That's right, Space Laser Tag. There you go. But for now, let's just drop off the stuff to this girl. Where are you? There you are. Oh, she's got herself her own little room. Wait, they have to put everything in its place? Really? Why? And I go burn my dot. I mean, notebook, and we just never mention any of this again. Cool, cool. Yeah, that seems fair. Hey, I got money, a lot of money. So, what have I got? Holy Spirit. So I can do that in the next one. Yeah, I'll probably will do that quest in the next video, and then I'll also take a look around online. I'll do a quick Google search just to see areas where there will be side quests so I can carry on leveling up. Because I don't think I'm going to have to be level 18 to do the Katagawa or whatever it is uh, quest, like boss battle. I'll probably just have to be level 17. Five more missions and your contract's up! Then you're free to go! You said that five missions ago. No! I said five missions three missions ago, and three missions five missions ago! Get it straight, soldier! Besides, numbers don't matter! Wars matter! You wanna win this war, or what? Or what sounds good. I don't give two turns in a Vercuvian ham sandwich what sounds good to you, soldier! You signed a contract! If you wanna keep that Iron Bear unit, it's five more missions! Besides, I need you out there with the greenies! You quit, they die! Ugh, fine. One more mission. Where are we going? Darzeron Bay. F***ing motherfucker piece of f***ing f*** me! <laughs> well, anyway, I am going to call it a day here. Thank you all guys for checking out this video. It does mean a lot. If you could leave a like, leave a comment down below, hit the subscribe and the bell icons down, down below, the subscribe button and bell icon, just to keep up to date with the rest of this walkthrough, that would be perfect. And check out the end screen for stuff on my channel that you might be interested in. For now though, that's pretty much it. So until next time, do look after yourself and I'll see you then.